Hey fam, this is Hector Mirai, and you're listening to Faith and Vandom 180 on LTN Radio. So I'm playing Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, and so are my daughters. And we all started about the same time, and we're all kind of like, you know, tap dancing around each other as far as gameplay and where we are in the game, etc., etc. I gotta jump on my kids because there was a midnight release. And so <laughs> I can do what I want and they got to go to school. So I spent after the midnight release playing the game for like about six and a half hours before they got a chance to touch it. So I had a little bit more wisdom. Now on the flip side, out of that six hours I played, I spent an hour and a half of it lost because I went the wrong way and I tried to force it and make it on my own. So I gained some wisdom in the subject and uh so as my kids were progressing in the game and they're getting in that same spot and say hey listen make sure you go here instead of here because i did this and it went wrong and etc etc and you know they kind of listened and my 10 year old was like thank you and my 15 year old was like grumbling at me for kind of giving her directions like she was kind of ignoring me as i was trying to help then we got a little bit further in the game and uh there comes to a point where you have to go to a place called the Rito village and it's kind of hard to get to. And so before they even really got on their journey there, I said, Hey, let me tell you what to do to get here. And my 15 year old said, stop, don't tell me what to do. Let me struggle first. Then I'll come to you. And it, I was like, okay, fine. You're an independent woman. Um, but the reality is most of the time we want to do things our way and only show up to God when things don't go the way we want them to. I'm not God in this or anything, but like it just reminded me that we do that. We, we would rather kind of suffer than actually trust God's path for us. But Proverbs 3, 5, and 6 says this, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and depend not on your own understanding. Seek his will in all you do, and he will show you which path to take. I left my daughter alone to make her own choices, but you know what? 12 hours later, she was hitting me up and say, all right, where do I go? I'm just grateful to know that God's going to be there whenever I actually stop being stubborn and ask for help. If you'd like to learn more about Faith and Fandom, head on over to faithandfandom.org, where you can learn about our Comic-Con ministry, podcast, memes, apparel, and book series. You can even read new chapters before they make it to the next book. I'm Hector Mirai, and thank you for spending the last 180 seconds with me.